Leslie Meredith with Brave Bulk Events and Media, and joining me is Vincent Fan from Sinotrans, who has just finished a very interesting panel Thank you. Um, about a joint venture with Sarens. Um, but Vincent is here to talk to us about the growing trend of China um, moving out of China and expanding globally and doing projects all around the world. Tell us about that. Okay, you know, recently more and more Chinese companies, they are investing outside of China, I mean overseas. But for most of Chi Chinese, we cannot, or most of them cannot speak English very well. And uh, also foreigners, they are not very familiar with Chinese culture. Just take me as an example, because I lived and worked in Australia for two years. I first heard about rugby when I arrived in Australia, so I tried to involve with their commu community and trying to learn something about rugby, trying to communicate with them using their own language. Also, same to Western people coming to or working with Chinese people. Maybe you need to how to drink with Chinese, how to um, how to say how to play with Chinese, so how to. Uh, having dinner with Chinese, a lot of cultural things behind the real cooperation. So, both for Chinese and the Westerners, we need to adapt to each other's culture and learn something from each other. That will make us stand as a in a win-win standpoint. Okay, how important are those sort of everyday cultural understandings? How important is that to the success of doing business here in China? Okay, because if you want to win or succeed in a business, you need to communicate with people. Without easy or transparent communication, you are not going to succeed. I think that's the most important thing. Okay, great. Thank you so much. No worries. Thank you.